Hi there and welcome to our latest Microsoft Teams Hints and Tips video. In our last video I showed you how to create a public team site and now I want to show you how you can add channels to that site. So let's revisit the one we created last time which is this one here, Test Public Teams and I created it and added on my colleagues Phil and Emma into that team. Now generals always created automatically when the team site has gone live but to add more we click the three little dotted options button here and click add channel. Let's give it a test name. We don't. We could give a description if we wanted, but you don't need to. Now the privacy settings is really new to Teams and it allows you to give two options. You can have it so it's standard, so everyone within that team can view the channel, or private, so you can have specific people. So the purpose of this, let's just leave it so everyone can see, and we'll click add. And you see it automatically creates. So let's create a private channel. So we do the same process again. Let's call this test private channel. And we don't need to do the description because it's optional. And let's just say it's private. So then we click next. Now at this point, I need to invite the people who I want to in this private channel. So let's just say it's my colleague Emma. No offense to Phil. And let's click add. And done. Now she will, Emma was now receive a notification that she's been invited to this channel. And as you can see, there's a little padlock sign here. And this means that it's private. So only you and Emma, or myself and Emma, will be able to see this channel and Phil won't be able to. That's all for now, and hopefully I'll speak to you soon again.